All right, what is going on guys? Dead Trigger here, and as you guys can see in today's video, we're gonna be talking about the top 10 best friendships in Mortal Kombat 11. Now, I do want to quickly mention that this will all be in my personal opinion. If there is some things you agree or disagree with, please let me know in the comments. I would love to hear it. But there is only one honorable mention I have for this top 10, so let's get right into the video, ladies and gentlemen. So coming in at my number 10 spot, we actually have Baraka's friendship. And what I love about this one is that he randomly pulls out a cake from out of nowhere. Nobody knows where it came from. But once he pulls it out, he throws it up in the sky. And as it is thrown in the sky, he takes out his blades. And as the cake is falling, he starts slicing it like crazy, like if he was a little kid at a birthday party. Now, what's funny about this one is that even though he sliced almost the entire cake, there is one piece left that he forgot. And I guess it just randomly fell on his head and he looks up and thinks, where the hell did it come from? The fact that it hits his head and he is just so confused at the end makes it even funnier and it's why it comes in at my number 10 spot. So coming in at my number 9 spot, we have Garrus' friendship, and at first you might think to yourself, okay, it's Garrus, he is the sand god, and of course, he's gonna be building a sand castle, there's no other way about it. However, this one in particular, it's no ordinary sand castle, this is a sand mansion. Towards the end, he also pulls out this little tiny flag that has a sun logo on it with sunglasses on. Guys, this is meant to be for Garrus. He builds an extraordinary sandcastle, which I think is phenomenal. I've never seen one in the real world this big before. It's why it comes in at my number nine spot. Moving on to our number 8 spot, we have Sonya Blade's friendship, and this one is a classic game of fetch with your pet, and in this case, the pet is that little robot. Now, what's cool about this one is Sonya throws a stick, and as the robot runs to go get it, Sonya stares at it for about 3 seconds, and then out of nowhere, this little robot pulls out with a Tarkatan. So instead of the stick, this robot literally takes out a whole human being and brings it to Sonya, and that's, that's just amazing. That just talks about the friendship itself, and that's why it comes in at our number eight spot. Friendship. Raiden wins. Flawless victory. So coming in at our number seven spot, we have Raiden's friendship alongside Kid Thunder. And what I love about this one is that there's these group of people that are dancing. As you guys are seeing on screen right now, they're basically using every single Mortal Kombat character in Mortal Kombat 11. And everyone's either dancing, fighting, doesn't matter what's happening. Raiden has the exclusive friendship where he alongside Kid Thunder are dancing in the lights and it looks really amazing it comes in at my number seven spot what they did in that video was amazing and i truly truly hope that we see more of this in the future Coming in at our number 6 spot, we have Nightwolf's friendship and anytime I see this friendship, it brings me joy because it starts off with the wolf jumping through a hoop perfectly after an uh, eagle lands on Nightwolf's arm and finally, out of nowhere on the left side of the screen, you see Nightwolf's bear walking on a ball doing a trick basically. It looks amazing, it brings joy to Mortal Kombat 11, this is what a friendship is supposed to be and even though it is number six it is still one of the greatest friendships in the game coming in at my number five spot we have kitana's friendship 
And yes, she's only this high because Melina makes an appearance. I get that all the Melina fans out there could be a little bit, let's just say, annoying sometimes. But at the end of the day, if Melina ends up not showing up in Mortal Kombat 11 and the best they could do for us is just give us a friendship for Kitana where she makes an appearance, I'm okay with that. For now, she's going to be at my number 5 spot, but if Melina does end up being in the game, she's for sure probably not even going to be in this list. But Kitana for now comes in at my number 5 spot. Coming in at my number 4 spot, we have a Noob Saibot, and what I love about this one is Noob Saibot is a character that is dark, that is groomy, that is gothic, that is very, very deadly, no matter the version. Imagine, he summons two shadows, each shadow grabbing one part of a jump rope, and as they're moving it, Noob Saibot starts doing backflips. This gothic character starts doing backflips, tricks, and dances while jump roping. Guys, Noob Saibot hands down has one of the best friendships in the game because although he is this dark character, we see the true Noob Saibot in this friendship. That's why he comes in at my number four spot. <laughs> Moving on to our number 3 spot, we actually have the Joker's friendship. And this one, no matter how many times I will see it, that animation that he makes when he gets hit with that battering, the facial expression that he makes will always make me laugh. And every single time I see it, it always puts a smile on my face. And that's exactly what the Joker does here, that's what he's meant to do. Towards the end, he takes out some balloons and he says sorry to you. This is something that you see in the Joker, that soft spot of Joker. This is why it comes in at my number 3 spot. Hands down, the funniest friendship in Mortal Kombat 11. However, there are better ones here. And let's move on to the number 2 spot now. At our number 2 spot, we have what I consider my main in Mortal Kombat 11 and also my favorite celebrity of all time, my boy Arnold, the Terminator. And ladies and gentlemen, what I love about this friendship is the fact that he hops on his motorcycle signed by Johnny Cage, stands on it, gives you a thumbs up, and smiles right in front of the camera. And after that, he starts doing motorcycle tricks. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna step back for one second. I'm stepping back for one second. This, to me, is one of the greatest friendships in Mortal Kombat history. I don't know all the friendships from the old school era, but this one right here from Mortal Kombat 11 is one of my personal favorites. But there is one friendship out there that beats this, and we're gonna be moving on to that number one right now. Terminator comes in at my number two spot. And finally, coming in at my number one spot, we have the greatest saxophone player of all time, your boy himself, Jax. And ladies and gentlemen, you know what this friendship reminds me a lot of? Anytime I see this friendship, so many things go in my mind, so many things like this. So that's it for today's video guys, hope you guys enjoyed it, leave a like if you did, let me know in the comments if there's any top 5s, top 10s that you guys want me to do, give me some ideas here cause your boy is struggling now, but thank you guys so much for the recent support, I really do appreciate it, we'll see you guys next time, see you in the next one ladies and gentlemen.